Scene. I want to make uh, bring in right now Marielle Liu, our reporter who was on the scene there in in, uh, in Jefferson, the community of Jefferson in Ashtabula County. There's been a house explosion there, and Marielle Liu is on the telephone. Marielle, what can you tell us about the scene there in Jefferson in Ashtabula County? Leon, good afternoon. You know, investigators are still here on the scene right now. It is a modular, double-wide style home, and there is absolutely nothing left. Only the shell of this house. It's not even standing. There is debris blown across the street into neighboring yards. Windows have been, have been blown out. There's a car parked in front of the house that exploded, completely covered in debris, insulation, and notes inside the house. Uh, again, we are still watching investigators going on to the, the house property, checking things out. When I got here at 9.30 this morning, uh, crews were on the scene putting out hot spot fires underneath the smoldering debris. The damage reaches clear out to the street and, again, to neighboring homes, windows blown out, other uh, pieces of property siding on other homes, severely damaged. Uh, there was one victim. He was treated here on the scene, and then he was taken to a local hospital. But neighbors actually had to stop this victim because he tried to drive himself to the hospital, which is good news. That shows instantly that he was not uh, severely hurt, but a little disoriented, clearly, as neighbors had to basically hold him down before uh, or in order to allow help to come to the scene and come to him. Neighbors from as far as three miles away say that the black that the blast shook their homes, knocked books off of their bookshelves, and they say a black and orange smoke filled the sky. Now, there is a propane tank on the property of the house that exploded, as well as the neighboring houses across the street and all the way down the road as far as the eye can see. But investigators still say they will not speculate as to what any cause of this explosion could have been because there are several oil and gas wells that feed into all of these homes. Leon. So it sounds like a very, it is a very touchy situation. Mario, you said there was one victim that, that we know of out there. Was this, a, was this explosion felt in a far-reaching area there in Ashtabula County? Absolutely, Leon. Again, people, I've been here since about 9 o'clock this morning, and obviously when something like this happens, it instantly becomes an attraction that people want to drive uh, and come and see. Uh, but people came over to this area um, from three miles away, saying that this explosion, Leon, shook the walls in their houses three miles away, knocked pictures off of their walls. Everyone in this area said as soon as their houses shook, they knew exactly what happened. They just didn't know where it was. Many thanks. Morel Lewis handling this story for us in Jefferson there in Ashtabula County. And Morel is in the process of gathering pictures. And certainly we will have more on later editions of News Channel 5. Many thanks, Morel Lou, for handling this story for us.